from Massachusetts in the Nastia Lucan Supergirl Cup. This is 13-year-old Michaela Skinner. They call her McKay Kay, because it wasn't that long ago that that was probably the way she spoke. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> her two older si sisters both did gymnastics, and she cites them as the reason for getting involved. Wow. A lot of power. Certainly not a lack of that. Stepped out, you see the yellow flag being raised. That'll be an additional tenth of a point they'll take off at the end of the exercise. Michaela Skinner, 13 years old. Her goal, another, who uh, really has her eyes on the Olympics, collegiate gymnastics. This is her favorite event, the floor. Rebound off the table, and hence the fall. And here now, Michaela Skinner. 13 years old, we saw her in the first rotation. Started on floor. Scored a 9-2. Put her in 15th place. Finally gets the, the green flag here. Wow. Oh, nice double Big ball. ball. Big ball. Very nice. Of course, the Tyson American Cup is following this tomorrow night. I believe we'll see that exact same ball from the two Americans, from Rebecca Bros and Ellie Raceman. So this is so much more difficult because she'll add another full twist. The only problem is watch her chest here. You see how she lands? with it bent over, and that step was a big one. But the difficulty of that vault, tremendous. Really to fix, to fix those couple of problems, she, she needs a little bit more speed, generate some, some additional power down the runway, and then, and then not lose any of that from the transition into the round off and then onto the board. It's better. Much better. Way better. You know, it's funny though, that, that was a big ball, Nastia. She, she took that big step back, but she still had that still pipe had that down. Pipe. It's, you know, it becomes somewhat of a habit sometimes, right. even though you don't need it. Back at the Nastia Lucan Supergirl Cup, this is Michaela Skinner over at the bars from Gilbert, Arizona. Seventh grade, youngest of five kids. She had older sisters who did gymnastics. She's actually an aunt. Can you believe that? She has four nephews. Wow. Her siblings, obviously, are quite a bit older. <laughs> <laughs> she has been to camps at the ranch, national junior vault champion. And she's doing a great so job so far. Presently in fourth position. Had some big numbers. Got a 9.65 on vaulting. Now on floor exercise, Mary Jane Ford. Mm -hmm. 
we're so used to the other scoring system. If you have a, if you're behind by 0.3, that's a little bit bigger than if it were in the other scoring system, right? Without a doubt. Yeah. But I have to tell you, it is really, it still is cool to see a score like a 975 yeah. be thrown out there and brings back memories. <laughs> All I got to say is that is quite a bow, I'll tell you. <laughs> there we go. this height, the hardest thing is to get from the high bar to the low bar and vice versa. She's a little girl. Doing some big stuff. Full twisting double. Pretty good routine. Not bad. Another one of the youngest compared, 13 years old, right? Mm-hmm. Waiting the beam score for Amelia Hundley. There you see Skinner in seventh place after the third rotation. We'll see if she can move up here. Now on balance B, Michaela Skinner. Also another one with very high hopes and expectations. Her goal, to be in the Olympics. Hundley's beam score, 9.325. And I'll tell you, coming into this last round, it is so tight, the scores. She was in a tie for seventh place. But the next four gymnasts, it's like less than a tenth of a point. Very nicely done. 